how do we start to actually go through some of the content that I'd like to be sharing with my students virtually? You can see here when I click on the share tray, which is the rectangle in the center of the screen, that allows me to then share either everything on my desktop, individual windows, or again, I can even collaborate together in things like the whiteboard. Now, something to be aware of here, if you share everything on your desktop, that means people will see a view of all of the apps that are open. Now, this is fantastic. Let's say maybe if you want to show your students how to use a um, certain program like Photoshop, I can now share my desktop and any app that I have running on my desktop, my students will now be able to see. But I just want my students to see a specific PowerPoint set of slides. You can see here, sharing the desktop is great if you're in a low bandwidth environment. But if you would like students to also be able to move through the content at their own pace, you can see here when I go through and click on Browse, I'm actually going to add a specific slide deck that I'm going to present to my students, which is my week two tech design. When I click on share, what that will now do is it will load up in the screen and all of the students will now see a view of the slides themselves. I can then click through the slides and now start having a conversation with my students directly in the context of this material here.